Randall Bennett for TechV.com with Michael Bingham from SRS Labs. We're going to be talking about the My Volume adapters. Now, these two little devices, they might not look like a huge thing, but what they do instead is fix your volume. So, if you have yeah. inconsistent volume levels, you're watching a movie, maybe a TV show, those commercials get really loud. These will actually dynamically adjust it on the fly. Now, Michael, yeah. You know, this is a, a really complex technology. Can sure. you kind of, sort of boil it down for people who might not understand exactly how this works? Yeah, basically, one of the leading consumer complaints is, is volume fluctuation. So we looked at and said we want to fix this problem so that people can enjoy you know, the dynamic range of their content without uh, introducing funky artifacts that destroy the content. Uh -huh. And so what it does is when, you're, when your audio stream comes in, it monitors about 20 frequency bands. And then it figures out using a, an algorithm uh, to determine, okay, what is uh, good volume fluctuation, what is bad volume fluctuation, if, the, if, there's, if that makes sense. Yeah, so like, the, setting these up, it's pretty simple, right? Like, you just yeah. plug in an HDMI, in this case, to the port over here, which is HDMI in. On the other side, you plug the HDMI out, and you just plug that in your TV, and then it'll detect all of the signals and sort of correct for them? Yeah, yeah, it will, because it uses what's called true volume, which is our, our technology, and it's, it's looking for one thing, uh, rate of change. So yeah. it, when you commercials, when you go to a commercial break, it automatically shoots straight up to the highest volume possible. So it automatically recognizes, okay, that's that's yeah. not good. This is bad. Yeah, this <laughs> is bad. Where you know, when you have like, an explosion, that kind of rolls up into its high yeah. frame, and so it it, it intelligently it recognizes that. Yeah, it definitely makes sense. And so we. So yeah. with these two, the, uh, the the big difference, of course, between the two models. Is this is HDMI, and this is ninety nine dollars, right? Right. And this other one is RCA, yeah, RCA. and that's ninety. That's forty nine dollars. Forty nine. Right? And so, but with these two, also, you're able to. Uh, this is HDCP compliant, right? So it if is. you have one of those, if you have a Blu-ray player and a different monitor or whatever, it'll have working just fine with that. It, well, there won't be a problem whatsoever. It works. It'll work just the way you expect it to. And you have you have complete control of the volume. It's some people have asked, well, how does it tell me? How does it control the volume level? And that's really up to you and your thumb on your yeah, remote. Yeah. So the the end the end goal is to have that volume level you actually set be the actual volume. Exactly, yeah. exactly, and that's what it actually successfully achieves. Awesome. All right, Michael. Thanks for coming to the program. Really yeah, appreciate it. Michael Beach from SRS Labs. It's the My Volume Adapters. We have links, of course, to all the information at techv.com. See you later.